Right guys, so far this is the third video now, part three I guess. We've seen the products, still a lovely day in December. Seen the products, we've seen me clean my FJR, which is now over there, which looks pretty. The cam man should have gone over there when I pointed over there. Sorry. And the cam man's back again. <laughs> it's a new cameraman, don't worry. And then come over here guys. What am I going to use this time? We've seen all the products. I'm not going to clean it, because this is detailing. So, we're going to use endurance chain lube on the chain. Okay, man, go to the chain and then come back. Silicon for all the yummy bits. I've got to use this really rather than the speed polish and then this on other little bits. So, what needs doing on this bike today? Right, all this needs caring for, all this needs literally rubbing and, and literally just having a very nice time cleaning, polishing. There's little bits in here and this is ionising a little bit here. Rub all that down, and I may have to put some spray back over that to make that lovely and clean because it's filthy. On the metal bits, clean on discs. These are lovely discs, they're practically brand new, aren't they? So, fly stuff obviously. This is just a wipe down. Come on the side here, and again on the engine, more silicon to get all this clean. It's called detailing right in here with a shock and then clean round. So, guys, let's get on with all this cleaning. Again, I will start this at the end, guys. In case you haven't seen this start, a lovely video of it. It was my dream bike, as I said before. We're not chatting about my lovely dream bike. Yes, we are. I will start it at the end, guys, when I make it nice and clean. Hopefully, you've seen around it, and then you can see me make it nice and clean using more detailing than washing and cleaning. Uh, so, let's get on with it, guys. So, is this fun? Well, more fun than I think than washing personally. It's a bit sad, I know, I get enjoyment out of this. I mean, the engine has some parts here that could do with going over again. And this isn't just ordinary, um, you can't use just ordinary car sprays. This would have to be heat proof spraying stuff here around these pipes and so on. But I am getting, this is silicon. Is this a bit like back to black? Yes, it is. So a bit more expensive. Some of you eagle eye people might notice that wasn't there. And it is now, so I bought another one. They're a bit expensive though. And you have to have your Bluetooth cup of tea. Now it's got a little bit of damage this little baby has here. Let's get round to me. Um, missing screw here. So I'm going to have to drill it out and report that. This is the scratch that must have been turned around. So it was before me and you can never spot a little bit of damage. But um, I, I actually, sadly enough, I enjoy this. I enjoy getting all nooks and crannies and getting rid of every single piece of little bit of dirt and so on. And yeah, so then we're obviously going to speed polish these bits here. I'm going to put the polish tank. And there's a lot of black actually on this. And this is supposed to be good for that. So we'll do that as well. And I want to get in every single little bit here. And then clean with the... Oh yeah, I did, didn't I? On that kit, I've got some chrome cleaner. So let's chrome clean that. Haven't done that one yet. Anyway guys, as I say, let's get on with this little baby. Give it a lovely clean. Because when I do ride this, and it will be a sunny day like today, to be honest with you, yeah, I could definitely go out on it today. But I'm not going to. I'm going to wait till it gets really nice and warm. And I'm going to show her off. Because uh, she deserves loving. Let me have a cup of tea. Alright, guys. So guys, what products did I use to finish this off? These ones today. Clean the brakes. Speed polish is brilliant. I've got to say that's good. Does a good job of it. I haven't tried the other heavy duty polish, but there's not much to this bike. Silicon spray everywhere. And obviously the endurance on the chain and a little bit of metal polish that I bought that was separate as well. Okay guys, to me, is this kit um, worth it? Will I continue using it? I think these products I most certainly will. Washing it, do you know what, the jury's out there. I um, still think good old sponge and washing up liquid works really well. It's got silicon in it anyway. Um, but I'll keep up with it, I've bought it and I'll keep up with it and see how it goes. But as I promised, back to the bike. She is beautiful, 1340cc, same as the Hayabusa engine. If you 
fancy looking at a better one of this running and everything? Why does my dog always get in the video? <laughs> better than the chickens and other videos, I guess. There are some blemishes on this and a little bit on the engine that I've got to use some proper spray for, um, heat proof paint and so on. But battery's low, I've got a brand new battery. I don't know if I should start. Let's just see, shall we? That's it guys, so far muck off, yeah, thumbs up so far guys. Guys, check out the links around the outside, please like and subscribe, and I'll uh, keep making them.